is Trish. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am currently in Ho Chi Minh City in Vietnam and today we are going to our shopping. I'm very very excited. Uh, the last time I went here was in 2018 and I am going to be shopping with the same sales associate. She was so nice in 2018 and I still had contact with her on Instagram and texting on Viber. And yeah, you're gonna see her again today. And this is the mall I'm at right now. It's called Union Square. They got all the luxury uh, boutiques here. They got uh, I think Rolex, or maybe it's at the other mall, but they have a lot of stores here. But we don't have time to go look at other boutiques, just Dior only today. If you guys are new to my channel, subscribe and follow me on Instagram. Today I will be looking at Dior. Mostly the handbags because I do want to get a handbag here, kind of also like a souvenir. And I'll do an unboxing when I get back to Vegas. So let's go and head in now. Okay, so we are finally in the Dior Boutique in Vietnam, Ho Chi Minh City. This store is located at Union Square and we are taking a look at fashion jewelry first. So I actually have not purchased any fashion jewelry in forever. So it was really nice to finally take a look at some fashion jewelry again. I'm really digging the tribals. At first, I was not a huge fan of these tribals with like the big pearl in the back, but now I look at it again, it's actually pretty cool. And my cousin and I, we were talking about it. And I'm like, I think this would be really cute on you. And yeah, we were just basically looking at all the different kind of pieces right now and I was mainly looking for like items that only Vietnam had and then I wanted my cousin to try on this ring but it was a little bit too small for her so I put it on her pinky but it's actually pretty cute a little like CD ring and again you guys fashion jewelry is not real gold it's like um, aged metal gold um, but it's still really nice but make sure to not get your fashion jewelry wet because it can change colors so those are some really cute earrings and rings and we have some Dior belts and I'm really digging these cd belts they're really gorgeous then i took a look at the dior men's and this is a dior men's handbag which i don't recall seeing actually so it might be newer or i've never really paid attention that much but i thought it was pretty nice a crossbody bag and then we have some dior men's shoes and i really love like the layout of the store it's very beautiful and very bright and i'm digging all of these sneakers i love dior sneakers and so does my dad you guys saw him pass by earlier he was wearing that dior backpack very cute um but yeah these are kind of like dior bowling shoes in a way they, they remind me of bowling shoes but i love them i would definitely consider them in the future but right now i mainly have my eyes on like dior women's shoes but they're all very stunning very beautiful different styles different colors and my dad loves dior sneakers and he says it's comfortable so i think it's great then we have Dior men's ready to wear i'm loving the bobby ones because bobby is dior's dog in the past and the dog's name is bobby that's why also the handbag is called dior bobby so that is a little fact for you guys if you didn't know um but yeah i really love that the dior men's have like the bobby on like the sweaters the sweatshirts and like the t-shirts i love the way they incorporate it i wish they make something for dior women's too maybe in the future and now looking at some women's handbags and we have a few handbags actually for the new collection and this one is a new one right here this one is the dior se bag and it's in french so hopefully i said that right but it's basically a bucket bag you can wear it cross body and there's a top handle which i think is super cute i didn't actually try it on because i was looking at other stuff but they have really cute handbags i didn't really see any handbags that america didn't have maybe the exotics but most of these you can get in america the main thing why people prefer to buy luxury international is because you can get your money back or save money as well um from the airport which i will explain in a different video for you guys so yeah i'm really digging that small dior book toe i don't have a small size yet that's why i really want a small tote bag and then we have the medium dior these are the dior delights so i wanted to try on this new handbag this is for the latest collection and i thought this was super cute so this is the new handbag and they actually just unwrapped it for me because it was still brand new uh, in the plastic wrapped in everything so this one is called the dior miss caro so it's basically a dior caro bag but in a different kind of 
uh, design, more like a different size. So it's a bit smaller, but it can fit my phone, which is really nice. So you can double wrap the chain. You can wear it as a shoulder bag. You can wear it on your arm. You can also wear it like as a top handle. You can also wear it cross body, which I think is super cute. Here it is. Well longer form on my shoulder and you can also adjust the strap as well so this is in black they also have it in beige then i also tried on this other smaller handbag it's the uh miss dior mini miss dior and it's also a crossbody bag i really love the chain on this bag and i love that it has a top handle so you can kind of wear it as like a little clutch bag as well and then the open closure is magnetic and it can fit a lot as well. There's card slots and this is how you open the other handbag. Just twist it and then open it up. And it is in lambskin, by the way. There's a little zipper compartment and a lot of Essa, uh, a lot of card slots as well. This one is the Dior Riviera collection, which I am obsessed with. They have D-Way slides, they have tote bags, mini Lady Dior, and it's just also pretty. And I really love like these display. Do you see that kind of like stone-like D-Way and also the stone-like Lady Dior? It's really cool that they have these kind of like displays um, or like actually like a sand because it's the beach collection. So I think it's super cool. They don't, i never seen that in the USA. So they have like different kind of displays for Asia. Then this one is the Delight, uh, Delight but it's in the mini size. Uh, and I think it's so cute. It's Dior Riviera where we have pink and gray toiletry. I am obsessed. This one is um, another delight. Um, well, actually, the other one is just a regular mini Lady Dior, but it's kind of like a it's a wicker bag. This one is the delight in the mini, and I just love toiletry. And then we have some scarves. And then I was looking at this small book tote. Like I said, I don't have the small size yet, so I'm pretty obsessed. And you can personalize your name or initials in a bag. You can put symbols and hearts and stars and bees. Then I looked at some jewelry and this is the Rose Devance collection and I wanted to try on the Dior Amour necklace which is the newer collection that just came out. They have it in the necklace, ring, and bracelet but I don't think they have an earring of it. So I wanted to stack it with my Rose Devance. I think it looks super super cute and yeah it's very beautiful it's in yellow gold let me know what you guys think of this necklace does this stack work i think it's very very cute then i got some water and i love that they put it in a canage glass cup usually in america it's just like a water bottle but here in asia they put it in a glass cup for you and this is more of the dior rivera collection but the woman's ready to wear this is just like kind of like a bra kind of top it's not really a swimming suit this is the swimming suit right here. It's a bikini top and then bikini bottoms in the pink gray toit de jouy, which I'm really obsessed with. I love toit de jouy, and this pink gray color is so much better than last year because last year was like super bold and very like highlighter because it was like a really bright blue bright orange but this year is a pink and gray which is really really stunning and then this one's just a part of the current fall collection 2022 uh or sorry 2023 and yeah it's very very stunning and i love that the animals on there we got the elephant but that is it for the shopping vlog stay tuned for the unboxing i will explain it back in vegas we just got out of Dior, but we are looking for a taxi right now. This area kind of reminds me of Rodeo Drive. Right here we have Hermes, and then in front of me is Louis Vuitton. I wanted to check out Tiffany & Co, but we don't have any time left. We are about to go get a massage. This is my cousin Connie. And then we're going to have dinner together and probably go bowling and get boba later. Um, I wish I had more time. I wanted to go to Tiffany & Co, but no time. All right, guys, we are getting some banjang. Um, it's, it's basically Vietnamese pizza. This is right from the luxury mall right here. Nom, nom, nom. Is it good, Connie? That is good. The, the one I had, like, inside out. Just shrimp inside. Not bad. Yeah.
so that is the end of today's video i hope you guys enjoyed this shopping vlog in ho chi minh city vietnam i will do an unboxing when i get back to las vegas and i'll be explaining all the information you need to know about how much money you can save is it better to buy in asia or in usa how much money are you saving all the information you need to know but if you have any questions leave it down below and i will answer it in my unboxing video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram and i'll see you guys next time bye